Hello, I'm Cabot, and today we'll be doing chapter 12 of Radiant Down, Fantasy Fair Color Only. It's called The Price. This is chapter 12 from Part 3. The goal is to defeat 40 enemies. It's the same kind of clear condition as the last time we were using the Dawn Brigade. So we have only the same units as before, except we have our names here and there are other yellow units. This time yellow units don't matter that much, it's beneficial, they can maybe some hit some enemies, which make which would which should make things faster. The difficulty on this map is that there are some flyers that will go up here to defeat those enemies. So what I'll do is I'm South Mikaya and I'll leave Toroneo here because he can still be here. And I'll give him some items because healing on non-allowed units is allowed. Like I did that on early on the panels. And I'll try to defend these tiles and beat the enemies with soul. Nikaya has resolve because I think it can activate mid combat, which means that she could not get double if she gets hit. Because right now she has only 15 speed and this enemy can double her. She's she has enough HP to leave one hit, so yeah, resolve is for her to not die against one single enemy. I think that will work. And then we have our own Cypher and Fiona. Fiona is still bad, and at most I might be able to do damage with Javelins. Uh, last time I wasn't able to do that against Tiger, so let me check the defense. 20, 19, uh, this one is unpromoted, 13, 20, and 19, with a javelin I'm doing 16, that's 7, with the sword spear I'll be doing 90. So you won't do damage to these enemies with a ranged weapon, you can do damage with the sword spear against this one. And I guess you could also do damage with Emperor against the Emperor Motus soldiers. If you're using a melee weapon like this one, you can most certainly do some damage, even if it is only 5 points. So I could maybe give you some experience. I, I'm trying to keep you alive. This is a 2 tile choke point that I'll be using with Aaron and Sykar for all this map. Aaron has cap strength, skill, and defense. I could master crown him. I got two master crowns already, so I could make them both tire free. I decided not to because I rather get stats on the stats that I don't have cap. I'll use stat boosters if I needed to for the next map because I have them. And that way, maybe Sefar will get more strength this way. And you could maybe get some speed, because uh, you are guaranteed at least one start. I think Cypher is the one with Paragon right now, because he has two less levels than Aran. That's also the reason why I didn't want to make them tire free for this map, because they should get more experience if they're not tire free. Yeah, the stats won't be speed, nor skill for Cypher, nor strength, skill, nor defense for Aram, but that should still be fine. Um, yep. Uh, let's save.
I'll trade you a melee weapon after. I have a support now with Cyphark and Aram, so they have now Fierce Boy when they are nearby. 10 damage. I don't think Fiona can do that much. You are one point sore, and you would die by 20 priests. Mm. I'm just saying that you are exactly one point sore. Let me see if I can at least do some cheap damage. There's a 3% chance I get spirit. Uh, sorry, a 3-2% chance I get this. I get some spirits. Less because it's too worrying, but I hit. So that's some base spirits. I think I got like 10 base spirits. Uh, well, that's not base experience, it's still experience. I'll give you the steel sword. I like to keep the kill nets for the next map. Let's see how much experience you get from this enemy. 15 experience? That isn't bad because you're the one without Paragon. Tough has celerity. That is for him to reach. Toner here, one torus toner. Doesn't really matter. And I forgot to give Toronail healing items. I mean, he's not taking that much damage, but I still like to have some. I'll get this concoction from Mikaya because he's not going to use it. I forgot to tell the Yellow units to do something. But that's fine. I don't need the yellow units to do anything, really. They can do whatever they want. And by letting them free, I have a healer here, so that's helpful. So, if we get 10 experience per enemy, for each enemy, and that's 40 enemies we have to be, we would be talking about like 4 levels, which is a match. So, I guess at most I reach around level 15 on both Sykar and Aran. 23, seriously? A yellow unit also doing also dealing 23 damage. So that tile where Sykar is can be a he can face two enemies from melee, which isn't great. But because of the air support, a air support, and he's the sword master, he's the fastest one, dog stunking for him should be quite good. See um this guy is tile two and has less than 50. Right. 
And because Seihar is the one with Paragon, I kind of want him to face more enemies than Aran. Well, that's that's not good. I mean, it is kind of good in the sense that I'll be fighting enemies now. I have passed on Fiona, right? The re reason is that uh, this could happen. I could have enemies, and I will probably have enemies on all three tiles next to Iron and Sidehar. So happen that those enemies or some others have the HP low enough to be defeated by Fiona with a melee weapon. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So let me see if I was correct or not. I was not correct because Fiona does almost no damage. But yeah, you get the idea. This just didn't happen for this enemy. Let's see how much experience I can get from a kill against a tire 2 with Paragon. We're to experience, we'll take that. That's not enough. I had to be careful about those enemies because I didn't see them. You have nine more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It is the tiles. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I guess you had to fall back here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This tile should be safe. This one should also be safe. You don't have a ranged weapon, just to make sure. Uh, 
I'll move you I guess I'll move you here. That might be bad because if there's a ranged enemy, I could lose that healer. Okay, you hit, that's good. Now I don't need to worry about that flyer. Okay, enemy storm. Really, <laughs> Nea. Why? I'm not sure, but are my face one flyer? There's one level up. We got strength. That's good. Our oh, healing AI. Yay. You got hit twice. One eight speed. I don't think Fiona will. I don't think Fiona can attack that enemy. Yeah, Fiona can do that. Uh, and I need to heal Scyhark. Let me see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think I'm going to let these flyers do whatever they want on this Sci-Hark.
Now, can you get some experience? I don't think you can. You get you get doubled by tire one armor knights. I mean, that's experience. Period. They're moving to protect Mikaya. That is not bad. I wasn't expecting that. Hey, I. I'm glad for it. Well, like, I would like to get rid of flyers. Okay. because there's there are plenty of enemies to face it doesn't matter if some of them have killing AI I'll still be facing some enemies and it seems that Sahar isn't strong enough to beat them without crits or Adep and Arani is slow enough to also not beat them without crits Yay! You dodged one! Now you can leave one more turn. Or maybe even more if I defeat that flyer.
Now this. You have only two HP. I would need to get rid of this enemy in order to try facing that one. Can you do something? You can do one damage. <laughs> okay, sir. Player is quite far away. This might be bad. Because now a ranged enemy could attack Mikaya. I needed to move her that close. So if I lose, that's my fault. There goes the flyer. We have yellow units as a wall so at least some enemies might lose their actions before they could attack Mikaya. That archer got double. I could get crit and die. I could. <laughs> ah, that's. Really bad. I was not expecting that to be possible. It even happened, but like... Now I want to get rid of that enemy.
Okay, so there are prior reinforcements. That could be bad. Let's go that by having a let's go that by having a range weapon on Sidehar and a melee on Aran that Archer or Sniper will go for Aran instead. This isn't the unit I want to be sick. That could be bad. I don't think it'll be. I think this healer will heal Saifar then. Oh yeah, that's a uh, rock. I can attack the other <laughs> enemy. Okay, you heal Saifar as expected. And this other piece of heal so he got exposed, which isn't good. So this is enemy phase already, I, I wasn't looking. Yeah, I suspected that piece of my die now. You did your job for some turns.
I was hoping you to hit. Okay, there are only 20 remaining, so we're halfway. I guess I'll face this enemy. And now, let me see... I don't think you'll do anything. Uh, where's that sniper? He... fell back. He fell back, so... Um, best we'll be doing all the things. Like you can beat this enemy, that's great. You beat that enemy. Perfect. That's another kill. Eighteen. Forty-five, fifty-two. Let's go for accuracy. Let's see if I can get some experience on her. Yes, it goes. Gaia level up! Yay! Still do something. Nope. That's an empty level up. Okay. That's one hit. Yes, please. That's what I wanted. I was hoping that the enemy would go for her. This is going really well. I sometimes tend to lose the archers that are fighting uplets. And that makes the other, the other red enemies go above that and that's bad. It usually takes 
long enough to for me to get the clear condition. But like this is better than that scenario. Yeah, I figured you would do that. You missed. That's great because I got this 10 damage. I was hoping you double him and beat him after so I could use that tile with so. At least this piece of went to heal a different unit. Sixteen remaining. I bought a steel knife on this map because I thought I would need it. I did not. That's another Cypher level up. More stand. That's good. That's free stats. That's pretty impressive. Nice grid. No damage. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, there goes that flyer. I'm not getting as much experience as I thought I would, but like, I still got two strength points on Psyhark. Okay. This should be we should 
probably need to three more turns. Let's see. We need twelve more pairs. You can PC Peace Archer. There goes another enemy. Okay, let's see if we broke a death. If not, it'll take two more turns, probably. Okay, then. I wonder how a tire one enemy has filled all the yellow units. I guess they didn't plan for they didn't go for them, but like come on. One HP. Maybe yes, maybe and Fiona kill. Maybe Oh, yeah, I have for this map really Volonara. <laughs> he wasn't dying. <laughs> you have 20. You could maybe get this kill. Maybe.
I guess Fiona won't get that kill just because I couldn't defeat these enemies. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There is a range enemy here, uh, so that's a no. This is an attack for one experience. We increase weapon rank. Top rank. You know, this isn't that bad because that means the enemies will be defeating are the ones with Saifar and Aran, which means more experience. Zero hit. I don't have a javelin, so this enemy is living. Maybe it's, maybe I can get this kill then with Fiona next turn. Maybe. That sniper is still here, I could have died. Well, I, I have 57 HP. If I have killed myself, I would not die by a grid. goes another level up. I didn't get strength, nor defense, nor luck, because I also don't have luck up. Can you reach Saifar? You can.
you're not dying against a tire <laughs> oh dear and you're not beaten him either so might as well use this because it's more accurate And now I'll be sick I hard because I wouldn't like to die by that crit. If I had to die by that crit, it has to be another hit on top of that. You got defense and 23 magic. I don't have a javelin, right? I don't. I mean... Will Fiona could still get this kill? If I don't meet the clear condition? That sniper needs to go. <laughs> well, uh, that's not the sniper, probably. <laughs> but like, I, I don't want... I don't want to face this grid anymore. <laughs> We need four more kills. So you're still having the crit against me. We got a level up on Fiona. Not worth it. I mean, I wasn't going to use you. <laughs> you got speed, which is okay, but like, I mean, I guess now you don't get doubled by this sort of fear. <laughs> I could do that, I don't want to. Probably next turn is the last one. Okay. 
there is I I think there is an atarm based experience for this map so we can just take our time we're not using this thing like they just don't care how long it takes this map to be beaten Taunted. I forgot I had that doesn't matter too much on this map it'll be helpful maybe for the next one If I can get a kill with Aran, I might be able to give him a level up, which is important right now because I'm going to make them tire free for the next chapter, probably. Okay, we got the level up. I mean, you gave me speed. We need two more. Uh, where is so? There it is. I can easily get two heals. Come on, I dare you to fail and get crit. No, it didn't happen, painfully. Mm. And now we need one more. I could do that with Fiona, but like, that's useless experience. Let's see if I can get this heal with you. It's not enough. Let me make sure I can have one kill. Okay, this is guaranteed. Could be dead. And that's not worth it. We got base experience. Almost 1000 other units base experience. We're still not just base experience. Alright, that's about it for this chapter. I hope you look I hope you're looking forward to the next one because it's it's chapter 313. I don't know if you I don't know if you know about that. I'll see you on that chapter. Bye.